What'd they say? I talked to the company in London, and they want us for the job. They want us there on the 22nd. What about the job? What job? I mean, uh, did they say what we're going to be building? I don't know. They said what they said in the letter. An interior design. And that we come highly recommended. Highly recommended. By who? I don't know. They didn't say. We get an offer for a job from somebody we don't even know. They won't tell us anything about what it is we're going to be building. And they give us an advance for $50,000. And they didn't say anything. They said to be there on the 22nd. Want some breakfast? Sure. Why don't you both come back to my house? It's not very far. You can relax there and we can sort out your ghastly transport problem. Just leave this land here for somebody else to haul off? Oh, my dear chap, the bike will be perfectly all right, I assure you. This is New York, you know. We'll be all right. In England, everything stops for tea. Are you all right? Oh, yes, yes, I'm, I'm fine, thanks. Do go in, I'll, I'll join you in a yes. minute. Yes, we're just staying for a cup of tea. Oh, I was told your motorcycle was beyond repair. No, it isn't. No, we'll get it fixed. In the meantime, we're going to rent a car. Oh. Well, you won't find one locally. There's a garage in town. Oh, Miss Walsh, you're not in Los Angeles now, you know. Hardly anyone in these parts has cause to hire a car. But Mr. Mount Olive chauffeur said he'd take you into the village tomorrow. They'll look after you there. Everything closes early at this time of year. If this room isn't your liking, we can find you another. Rough it for the night. Watch, watch your step, sir. Merci bien. Watch your step, madam. Jason Mount Olive fit in? Well, the five of us owe Jason everything. And in return, we run his businesses. When he calls us, we come. As you did. <laughs> but we just met him today. Yes, and now that you are here, we are six. You know what that means? The six? <laughs> what does it mean, the six one?
Mr. Mount Olive would like to see you. Only Miss Walsh. Here's where it's at. <coughs> the old boy's gonna die. <coughs> and we're here to bury him. <coughs> Ta-da! Let me get you some water. <coughs> That poor bastard is laying upstairs with his throat torn open, and they've got you running around down here trying to figure out where you came from. Honey, I gotta admit, they've gone to an awful lot of trouble to try to make you believe this whole thing. But this is too much. Look at that thing, it's laughable. Hmm. 
You're getting tough to deal with, Slim. I know. I've got the power. Yeah, I know you have. Now, what are you going to do with it? Anything I want. 